Today, I got a message from YouTube telling me I'm not allowed to make YouTube videos anymore. I, um, I literally can't, I can't believe I'm making this video. I apologize in advance if it's going to be hard for me to talk uh, during the filming of this video, but I have to make it since, uh, since I have to explain, I have to explain what's going on. About a year ago, with the rise of YouTube Shorts, I made another YouTube channel called Tall's Travels that is literally just repurposed content from this channel, The Traveling Clat, with over 250,000 subscribers. All it did was repurpose the travel content that I made here into shorts on a different channel called Tall Travels. I did new voiceovers for them in creative ways, making fun videos that ask a question in the beginning and then show you an immediate fun resolution at the end. We had content there from African immigrants to the Philippines, trans women in Thailand, Buddhist monks in Laos, yak farmers in Nepal, a, a truly an incredible channel. Today, I got a message from YouTube telling me I'm not allowed to make YouTube videos anymore. I'm being deplatformed from YouTube. Around a week ago, I got an email from YouTube saying that my channel was being terminated for spam. I run a bunch of channels on YouTube. I have one email that houses two YouTube channels. One was this Tall Travels travel account, and the other was my channel that shows the travels of mine through the Philippines and my life in the Philippines called Buhay Nital. YouTube suspended the Tall's travel account, deleted it, and kept up the Buhay Nital channel. I immediately responded to YouTube and made my case. And they said, you can appeal it, but it's been terminated for spam. So I appealed it, and they pretty much immediately responded with, uh, you can't appeal this. A human reviewed it, and uh, your channel is spam. And I'm trying to explain to them, like, hey, how is my channel spam? It's literally my content from the Traveling Cloud channel repurpose this must be some sort of technical glitch and the problem is with youtube being on this platform for 10 years you never get a customer support agent you never get any help there's nobody to talk to the only way i can reach out to somebody is via twitter at team youtube or through the customer support chat on the youtube end so with the appeal attempts via email failed i thought that i would reach my last attempt through the customer support agent because i don't have any contacts at youtube just to see what would happen. So I contacted Jules on YouTube chat support to ask her specifically about the Buhay Nital Philippines channel and how I could gain access back to that channel. She said to me, I was able to check out your channel. Here's what I found. I would like to let you know that I've checked everything I could, any alternatives we can do. I don't believe there's an easy way to tell you this, but the reason why you're not able to access this channel, the Philippines channel, is because your other channel got suspended. I do feel bad telling you all this. For you to gain access to that channel, you may have to fix the terminated one. We went through a back and forth just trying to understand and I told her I already appealed and she said, well, we already appealed so I can't really help you with anything else. And I told her they keep telling me that my channel is spam but my channel is clearly not spam. It's my content repurposed. I'm not spamming, not scamming anyone. There's no deceptive content. It's all happy-go-lucky travel content. It's great stuff. And then I told her my tallest travel channel is a channel with 111 subscribers based off of a channel that has 250,000 subscribers. This channel, The Traveling Clat. From what I've understood from YouTube's policies and what the team YouTube Twitter keeps responding me to with their automated response, they said, according to YouTube's policies, from what I've understood, because Tall's travel was suspended for spam, I'm not allowed to use any other channels on YouTube. Like, I'm not allowed to use this channel, the Traveling Clat channel. So Jules responded with, sadly, yes. Looking at the community guidelines strike basics on YouTube, if one channel gets terminated, you're prohibited from using, creating, or acquiring another channel to get around those restrictions. I wish I had better news for you, Tall. So I was like, I need to understand clearly, and you need to state it to me. Am I, Tall, not allowed to create on YouTube anymore? Am I not allowed to upload to the Traveling Cloud any longer? Can you confirm this? And she said, correct. She told me that she's gonna try to put me in touch with a supervisor to, to see if she can help me at least make another case. I got in touch with a supervisor, which was extremely unhelpful. And he basically kept repeating the same lines about spam. So I wanted to confirm again to see if I would get a different answer this time. So I told him, nothing about my channel, Tall's Travels, was spam or a scam. You guys haven't taken action against any of my other YouTube channels. I can still upload on them. There's no strikes on any of them. What happens if I keep using them? This is what broke me and made me decide to make this YouTube video. He said, with regard to your question, your other channels are still active right now and you can still do the normal things you do on it. So I told him, oh, so I don't have to stop creating on YouTube. He said, you need to know that once our system detects that those channels are owned or managed by someone who has a history of owning a terminated account, those channels might be removed as it's a violation of our terms and policies due to circumvention. So I told him, what am I supposed to do, man? You, I'm not able to appeal. I'm not able to make a case. I'm not able to talk to anybody. 
I've been on this platform for 10 years and I don't understand because he told me, he told me my channels are active and I can still do normal things on them. And the next sentence you said they might be removed. And he said, at this moment, your accounts were not flagged by the system. This means you can still use them. However, once our system's detected, they might be removed from the platform as well. We can't give you a specific timeline and I hope this clarifies it. I respond, what can I do, Jeff? He says, my sincere apology, I'm no longer able to help further with this. The decision on the channel was terminated, it's final, and even though the supervisor raised an additional appeal for you, the decision was not overturned. So I asked him, that's it? Am I kicked off of YouTube? He said, I know this is distressing news, but because one of the channels you owned or managed were taken down by YouTube, you violated our guidelines. You're prohibited from using another channel to avoid community guideline violations. This applies to all your existing channels, any new channels you create or acquire, and any channels in which you are repeatedly or prominently featured. I, I'm at a point right now where I don't know what to do. So if YouTube actually goes through with what they said they will do and delete all of my YouTube channels that are linked to me, including this one, I want you guys to at least know where I've gone, where I, how I've disappeared. Because for example, my Buhay Nital Philippines channel, they're not allowing me to access anymore. I have 12,000 subscribers on that channel. I'm not allowed to talk to them anymore. I can't even tell them what happened. 10 years I've been on this site. 10 years I have been traveling, making happy-go-lucky content. 10 years of adhering to YouTube policy. I've never had a strike. I've never had copyright infringement. I've never done anything wrong on this platform. I've always adhered to every policy, every change that YouTube has done. As much as it's hurt me financially, as much as it's affected me and made my life harder, I've always adhered to every single policy on YouTube. Mind you, the only reason why I started a shorts channel was because YouTube wouldn't stop promoting it. I, as a creator, I've been getting emails for years now telling me shorts, 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 shorts. I've never even really wanted to make shorts. I only did it because YouTube kept pushing it. I tried figuring out a cool, fun, creative way to format my travel videos into shorts and I felt like I did it because some of them did well. But here's my main issue. I've been a part of the travel genre for a long time on YouTube. I know almost every travel creator. Most of them I know by name. All of them have shorts channels of repurposed travel content from their long form to their short form. All of them. None of them have ever been affected by YouTube in the way that I'm being affected right now. And I'm speaking to some of them personally right now. They're shocked to hear what's going on with my channel. I'm not in the business of name calling, but man, there are some travel channels that make some shady content, especially when it comes to shorts. I've never heard of anything like what's happening to my channel happening before. It's always felt like it's harder to succeed as a creator of color, especially in the travel genre. But that has more to do with the audience than anything. I never in a million years would have expected YouTube who say that they support creators of color like myself. They wanna show diversity and inclusion the way that I do on my channel. Again, with all the incredible stuff we've done on my channel from fundraising to showing off local communities to showing communities who need help to shining a light on these people around the world, promoting local businesses, hostels, hotels. And I stay in my lane. I don't have a problem with anybody. I'm happy for everybody to succeed. But why would YouTube come after me? Why? It makes you question, is YouTube trying to silence a voice like myself? I'm shocked, guys. I don't know what to do. I really don't know what to do. I don't know how to fix it. I don't know if I'm going to be deplatformed. I don't know how to proceed with this. I don't know how to get it fixed. I don't know who to turn to. I don't know how to speak to. I'm making this video as like an appeal to hope and pray that somebody sees this that is able to get me in touch with the right person. but. I don't see it happening. I really don't. From what YouTube says, at any point, all of this can be taken away like this, at their discretion with no timeline given. I'm not able to make any preparations as a business owner. I'm not allowed to do anything. And the crazy part is I literally didn't do anything wrong. I didn't violate any of their terms. I made travel videos. That's it. Fun, happy-go-lucky travel videos with a good message. I'm reaching out to any YouTuber that I know that might be able to help me with this. If you watch this video, please, please, if you know somebody at YouTube, please help me. I, I don't want to lose everything that I've worked so hard on in the last 10 years. I, I don't want to say bye to this channel. I'm, I'm hoping and praying that this is not goodbye, but I acknowledge that it might be. I don't mean to be dramatic, but I really don't know what's going to happen. From what they're saying, it seems like at any moment it could just go by. If this is the last video I ever make on YouTube and this is the last thing you see from me, thank you all. It's been, it's been amazing. And I'm so heartbroken at the fact that it needs to end like this.
and I really hope that it doesn't. I hope I get to delete this video in a few days and pretend like this never happened. I love you guys, long time. Goodbye. If you believe in my content and you want to support me, just know your help is needed. You can donate to the channel via PayPal, buying me a coffee, joining my Patreon community, or becoming a member here on YouTube. Although they take the biggest cut. There's links in the description to all my videos that'll point you in the right direction. Your support is the only way that I can keep creating the content that you love to watch for me. Thank you.